What is up everybody? Thank you so much for tuning in to Antigone's Way. Today we will be talking about my Sunday routine and what I do every Sunday to prepare for the upcoming week. Thank you so very much for the returning people who are watching my videos as well as the new people. Welcome, welcome, welcome. So this is my first time ever making a vlog video if that's what you want to call it. And so if you all appear with me, that would be great. So yeah, I make my bed, I get up in the morning, pray, make my bed, that's the first thing that I do. Then I take a shower and get ready for the day because it's going to be a very long day today for me. On Sundays, I get myself prepped with food as well as what I'm going to do on my agenda. Here I have my grocery list and I'm checking it twice to make sure that I have everything on there looks like I do so yeah what I'm wearing today is a green peplum top with um, some black tights and a green hat yes hey girl yes y'all get into it get into it yes so um, I am on my way to Trader Joe's to get some groceries So yeah, I really needed to just get some olive oil and mushrooms here because when I tell you the Trader Joe's olive oil is everything, oh baby, it's everything, okay? Um, yeah, so I'm looking for the olive oil <laughs> and it looks like I went down the wrong aisle. Now here's the right owl. I am looking for the olive oil. I think I already picked the mushrooms up already, but yeah. So I love Trader Joe's olive oil. It is A1 to me, top tier. Just saying. Now I am on my way to Publix, cause you know I have to do multiple places. I don't just do one place, I do multiple. So I'm on my way to Publix now. I just love Publix. <laughs> I love Publix. <gasps> the watermelon are on sale. Oh, it just says fruit salad. I don't want the watermelon, but I'm gonna get some watermelon too. So y'all, I am in the produce section at Publix, and let me just say that I love the produce section at Publix. Um, it's a downgrade from Whole Foods, but I love it and nevertheless. I am on my way to get me some salad kits for next week and I am obsessed with these salads. I have been eating them for the past three weeks for lunch and they are wonderful. I have to check the lettuce because girl, you know you can't eat no brown lettuce with no salads, right? And I did not get any flowers on this trip this time because I wasn't impressed. Maybe the next time. <laughs> so here was my store haul. This is all of the stuff that I got today. And let me tell y'all, the way the food is priced today, oh my goodness, is ridiculous. I think I spent about on this stuff alone was over $60. And I think that is super duper ridiculous. But anyway, I'm gonna go over what I actually purchased. So I got some salads for lunch this week. So I got four salad kits, these are awesome. I got these from Publix. Got some lemon juice. I have some watermelon and some blueberries. I have some green beans and I was thinking about, I don't know if I wanna cook those tonight with dinner, but I'm gonna do mushrooms, some sauteed mushrooms, onions, and some dirty rice. So I got dirty rice and some long grain and wild rice mix. Garlic, of course, that is a must staple in my home. 
and some bell peppers and onions, some squash, Brussels sprouts, some okra. These were buy one, get one free, which were beef and chicken stock that I got. And I'm gonna make some banana nut muffins tonight. Because I'm making dirty rice tonight, I decided that I was going to go ahead and get some ground turkey. So I got some green wise ground turkey. Anyway, nonetheless, this is my grocery haul for the week. Yeah. So y'all, I gotta get ready to prep my meal for tonight. And I'm cutting this bell pepper. And um, yeah, <laughs> Chef Girl R Antigone up here trying to cut this bell pepper. But girl, I'm looking like I'm struggling. But anyway, I'm getting a job done. And um, yeah, this is what I've got going on is prepping my vegetables to saute. And I'm so excited about that. Ain't nothing like some good old bird's eye frozen broccoli. Honey, if it ain't bird's eye or fresh from the garden, then I ain't using it. So yeah. <laughs> This looks so chefish. Look at the garlic going in the pan. <laughs> I love it. I have to wipe the stove down because I do not like all of those little grease spots on the stove when I'm cooking. But yeah, look at that. Oh, so good. And the dirty rice. Oh my God. So I also soak my blueberries in some vinegar and baking soda because they are part of the dirty dozen and the dirty dozen means that they use lots of pesticides on them so I try to soak them in vinegar and baking soda and then rinse them off and bag them up. I know y'all heard that ASMR and I hope y'all got into it. But check out those muffins though. Don't they look good, y'all? Oh my gosh. Bakery status, okay? <laughs> so this is the meal of the night and I am so impressed. It looks so yummy. Mmm. <laughs> at the end of the night, I look at my planner to make sure I have everything in order for the upcoming week and if I need to make notes in it I'll do so and this doesn't take a lot of time because a lot of times I've already written things on Friday but I just want to you know kind of glance over it and look and see what I have to do so that it'll be etched in my mind of what I have to do and then I can wake up and know exactly what it is that I need to do so yeah this is um, what I do as far as planning is concerned. And I also journal because you know your girl is a big proponent of journaling. I like to write down how things have gone for the day for me, write my gratitude down for all the things that I'm grateful for. It's kind of sort of like a way of me praying, but I write it down in my journal, kind of having a conversation with God about the things that I am thankful for and the things that I would like to work on with myself and just, you know, writing my thoughts down so yeah that's what I do and y'all what is life without reading right now I am reading the untethered soul yeah 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 I know I'm late and it's been years since this book came out but okay anyway 
Um, I like to read something to take my mind off of social media and the television and things like that. So, yeah. All right. Well, that is all for my Sunday reset. Bye. <laughs> Bye.